it's been an interesting life, really, isn't it? To say the the least, <laughs> you've you've come a long way, haven't you, since hearing Mario Lanza belting out at your grandmother's. Yeah, it, it is a long, it is a long way, and I think you couldn't imagine. Well, I I, I don't think I would have imagined where I've ended up. Well, it's not the end, really. It's where I am on the journey, on this part of the journey. I, I, I wouldn't have thought that I'd be this age and still moving forward and doing something. When I was that kid listening to Mario Lanza and thinking, oh, I'd like to learn that song and sing it to my grandmother. Then later, and hearing Elvis Presley, and later on finding out, that Mario Lanza was an idol of Elvis Presley. Yeah, so, and then And Elvis Presley being one of my idols as a vocalist and a singer with what he could, first of all, his image, but then as a man and as a recording artist, then with a, the immense amount of respect for what he did and how unusual he was and, and everything. And then to, to be a record producer and take the idea from my head to the album, to the mixing and get it the way as close as you dreamed or imagined that song could be. And then for someone to come to me at one of my meet and greets and say, your song means the world to me. It got me through this. It's an incredible journey that i didn't expect i wanted this journey in music but i saw ronnie james dio the late very great legend of that we all know from rainbow and black sabbath and his solo career when i saw him at birmingham odeon which no longer does shows but every single band ever that was worth anything, played there from Iron Maiden, Metallica, Bon Jovi, Ozzy Osbourne, Diamond Head, everybody played there. I never thought that from that moment that I'd be here where I am doing an interview about my life as I'm waiting to go on to a tour of Sweden and (laughs) sing (laughs) songs that I've written and celebrate my uh, uh, past of Iron Maiden, who I saw three times at Birmingham Odeon, and never for a moment thought, "Oh, I'll be, oh, uh, oh, I'd love to have his job as a singer." You know, I'd like to be a singer like that, as successful, you know, on the with the big band, but never thinking that I would have that job. So it, it has been quite, quite a journey. 